so hello guys welcome to physics hub today in this video we are going to discuss about the most important topics from mathematical physics for the upcoming csi net uh, september 2020 examination so as you know that uh, the csi net 2020 examination notification has been out by nta csr so you can fill up the form the last date is maybe in the august 10th of august or something you can check it out and if you have not filled up the form yet fill it right now fill it by today or tomorrow okay so let's come to the topic so today what i am going to discuss we are going to discuss about the most important so top 10 so you know that recently from the last few years the paper pattern has been changed okay so you have to prepare accordingly now when i am talking about this most important topics so this is closely related to the syllabus means these topics are mandatory because these will help you to make your uh, make your basics and the difference between the previous papers and the papers of recent time is that here you are not getting a straight forward question although the concepts which will be which are being utilized to solve those problems are same but you are not getting direct question as you have observed in uh, last uh, last many years ago okay so you have to prepare at least these top 10 most important topics so that you can handle those questions very well and the best way to do that to practice more and more questions don't just blindly follow the solution try to think about it how the solutions we are getting and then only you will be able to cope up with the new types of problems which are coming recently in the uh, uh, recent year papers so before going to discuss this top 10 most important topics for mathematical physics i would like to recommend uh, three books okay so if you are preparing by yourself then you can take help from these three books i think most of you are preparing from these books the first book which i would recommend is mathematical physics by h k das and dr rama verma so this book is the best book uh, for csr aspirant especially and another book is there by dr b s grewal you can go for that book and other than that a book by erwin krisjig is there and uh, another book by afkan afkan book is also there but mainly these three books i would uh, like to recommend uh hk das b s grewal and erwin krisjig fine so let's come to the topic the first topic which i would like to tell you the dimensional analysis this topic is very important not only for the mathematical uh, physics portion it is in general very important in solving questions most of the time in every paper whatever paper you see in every paper there will be one or two questions which can be solved by using dimensional analysis like carefully cleverly so i am showing you one uh, particular poiqs from that section the how hot kind of uh, question you can expect from dimensional analysis and here one principle is very important i am just attaching uh, the pdf principle of homogeneity it states that the dimension of each of the terms of a dimensional equation on both sides should be the same okay so this is topic number 1 topic number 2 let's go to uh, non homogeneous second order differential equation okay non homogeneous second order differential equation so we have to uh, find out the particular integral and uh, this type of problem especially other a lo lot other types of differential equations are there but this particular topic is the most important and in addition to that the cauchy euler equation here it is quite related okay cauchy euler equation so this is special type of uh, differential equation you must practice few problems you should practice so that you can tackle this if it comes in the examination so the third topic is special function so you know the four type of special functions are there okay hermite bessel logier legendre so you have to like remember few things like um, i will be pasting the like short notes on special functions uh, like what you uh, have to remember you have to remember the form of the differential equation generating function and orthogonality relation so i have i'll be prov i'll be providing you the table of all these uh, special functions that will help you to tackle questions so one question you can expect from special function 
okay so a, a standard example from the previous year has been attached also uh, the fourth topic is fourier series and fourier transform okay I'm just for writing in short fourier so mainly fourier transform is more important from fourier series we don't get generally many questions but in <coughs> some years questions came from fourier series so you have to learn both fourier series and fourier transform and in general this fourier transform is also useful in uh, some of the topics of solid state physics okay condensed matter physics so that is why this topic is particularly very important and what is the purpose what is the purpose of introducing mathematics especially a, sp a separate chapter mathematical physics and physics because these are basically some useful tools which help you to explain different physical phenomena so whatever you learn in this mathematical physics portion you are going to utilize it in some other subjects you will go, you are going to utilize it in uh, condensed matter physics in in uh, atomic and molecular physics in quantum mechanics everywhere that is why these are whenever you start preparation mathematical method should be the first subject which you should start with okay anyway let's move to the fifth topic the fifth topic would be laplace transform it is equally important like the fourier transform and laplace transform there are certain rules which you should remember and you have to practice some questions uh, then tackling questions from laplace transform would be quite easy it's not that difficult and in almost every year you get one question from either fourier transform or laplace transform okay so you cannot guarantee that <laughs> this time let's say fourier transform came so the next time fourier transform will not come so you have to do both the <coughs> okay so i i will attach some formula sheet for the laplace transform as well uh, topic 6 is the contour integration contour on contour integration you know you we are used to solve normal integration but you will be given some integrations which are not easily solvable by using by following the direct method in those case complex analysis technique becomes a boon you can easily solve those integration by using complex analysis technique so one question you can expect from this contour integration uh, <coughs> several types of contour integration is there you have to take some semi infinite like semi circular path okay na some unit radius path sometimes you are also given some branch cut and branch point related problems also so <coughs> these two types are uh, generally very simple this is little complex but you can do it if you practice two three problems then you can easily solve and you can easily handle this problems related to branch cut and branch uh, <coughs> branch point okay so this was the sixth topic An Academy is India's largest online teaching learning platform. You can prepare for various competitive exams like CSR, NET, GATE, JEST, IIT, JAM, TFR. Especially if you are preparing for CSR, NET, Physical Science, you can join me on An Academy Plus. I cover all the nine units of CSR, NET, Physical Science syllabus. My approach is especially I precisely give you the concept of the concerned topic. Then I discuss the relevant mathematical formula and do the analysis. Relevant problem based on the topic, including previous year questions, are discussed. Homework and assignments are also given. This is my profile, and if you want to join my Anacademy Plus courses, you can enroll for this course. And if you are new to this Anacademy uh, platform, you can take Anacademy Plus subscription using our referral code Felixar, and Anacademy will give you 10% off. So take the Anacademy Plus subscription today and put your feet one step ahead towards reaching your goal. Thank you.